Hey guys, so it's really unbelievable how much science and technology have progressed in just a short amount of time in our lifetimes. We're already very comfortable with various techniques and more and more inventions, but the world still has some things that can take our breath away. So it's surprising, but there are tropical islands in the center of Germany in Brandenburg. Yeah, there's a magnificent lagoon with see-through water and snow-white sands with palm trees on the coast. And get this, exotic birds chirping too. But the most interesting thing is this miracle is inside a run-of-the-mill hangar. The only thing impressive about this structure before was its colossal size. It was a hangar for airships, after all. It's 1,200 feet long and 690 feet wide with an interior volume of 194 million cubic feet. It's worth noting that just three decades ago, Soviet bombers with nuclear payloads on board were housed in this place. They were ready to fly west at any moment and turn part of Europe into ash. Thank God those times are past. So now the former brand military aerodrome is a pilgrimage site for tourists from all over the world since it houses a unique tropical world created inside of a huge hangar for airships, one of the largest things built by humans in terms of internal volume. The huge structure is 350 feet above the endless forests, and it looks like an alien ship or secret Cold War military base. Now, the mammoth hangar size alone is impressive, but when you find out what's inside, you'll be floored. This hangar houses a unique tropical world with forests, pools, towns, and balloons floating under the dome. Tropical islands can be confidently included in the list of the most impressive wonders of Germany and the whole world. The company Cargo Lifter AG is responsible for the existence of the world's largest hangar. It was built in 1996 with the goal of creating cargo airships that can carry up to 160 tons. The company looked at 13 different places to accomplish their goals and settled on the Soviet brand military airbase just 37 miles away from the center of Berlin. Part of the base's territory measuring 1,300 acres was purchased from Brandenburg and the hangar's construction began a year later to produce humongous airships. So the hangar was finished in November of 2000. However, the idea didn't really take off, so to speak and the company went bankrupt. So the giant hangar would have remained empty if the Malaysian conglomerate Tanjung hadn't given it a look. The Asian sponsors turned the former hangar into a unique vacation park with its own microclimate. The equipment is bleeding edge and the park was called Tropical Islands. It can hold up to 6,000 people at once. The pools are made in natural styles and are surrounded by tropical plants. The hangar is like a real jungle. And what would a tropical forest be without exotic birds? This fantastic park is home to both small birds, as well as an entire lake with grand pink flamingos. Now, if you didn't have enough of the tropics during the day, you can even stay overnight. The complex has its own hotel. If you loved a vacation in the wild, you can even go to a small campsite. At night, the pool's water is lit blue. Vacationers can expect to find several first-class bars and cafes that are stylized as tropical huts. And to make sure visitors remember they're still in Germany, there's an entire village with German homes along the wall. There's a special place for children, too. They have several playgrounds where kids can play both on land and in water. One of the most popular things to do is to ride the water slides. There's year-round access to them as well. <laughs> How unique. Even if it is freezing outside, the tropical islands will always be a balmy 79 degrees Fahrenheit. And judging by reviews, it's a place worth visiting. And it's clear why. You don't have to fly far away to visit a tropical island. Would you want to go to such a place in the middle of the winter? Well, that's all for today. Be sure to leave a like and comment with what you would do if you were given a giant hanger. And uh, we'll see you again next time.